Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to connect Dash and Dot to your device. In this case I'm going to be using an iPad on iOS 12. So the first thing I'm going to do is check that my device has Bluetooth turned on. That's how your robot will see the iPad and the iPad will see the robot. I'm going to open up one of my Dash and Dot apps. I'm going to choose Blockly for this example. When I first get into Blockly, it's going to ask me to select my profile. This helps a lot when you have multiple students or users coding with the app. So I'm going to open up Mrs. Deputy, and I'm going to go back to a project I've done once before. In the top right-hand corner, it's asking me to connect um, my robot with a plus sign, but before I do that, I have to turn on my robot. So I'm going to choose, I'll turn on Dash first, using the power button on his side. And they often will do a little animation when you first open them up, so you may want to be ready for that. Hi, Dash. <laughs> We're going to search for Dash, and there he is. So I'm going to click RCPS3, and now I'm connected. He seems quite excited about that. So now that Dash is connected, we're going to turn on Dot using a power button in the back of her. Okay, and then now she's ready. I'm going to go back to that same spot. The plus sign isn't there anymore, but I'm going to click there. It's going to search for available robots. And you can see I'm already connected to this one, but I would like to connect to Dot. And we have added some customization, so you can see our RC, we've named them RCPS3, and we've made both of these orange so that they're easier to find. The way that you do that, let me connect this one first. So the way that you do that is when you open up that menu, once they are connected, you have this little gear icon down here, and I can go in and customize the name of my robot, the volume, the color, and even the, eye, the look of the eye. Alright, so now that we're connected, let's show you just a little bit of code. I'm going to put them side by side and play my code for you. And that is how you connect Dash Dot to your Bluetooth device.